right. Well, I'll send you a little bit, see what I can figure out. It's still like to have one of them come in here. But if they don't want to, you know, I can understand that. We can call them night. But I want to spend a little time in here. <laughs> All right. If that's how you want to talk to me, that's fine. Go ahead, tell me. You got my attention, just so you know what's going on in the recording. My radio has just gone nuts. It's locked on channel one. I am not touching any buttons in a solid state. Turn the volume down. I heard a voice on the radio. It sounded like the weather channel. But it's not roaming channel like it's supposed to be. Tri-fuel meter is going nuts. The radio, I stopped to talk on EVP session. The radio went completely nuts. It was going off like full blast static. It was crazy. I could hear voices on the radio. And now that I'm keying up, the tri-fuel meter is still going. But when I let go of the button like this, Look at that damn thing. Did you whisper? What? I Tell did. me. Huh? I did. Oh, <laughs> scared the shit out of me. You said we all wanted to come in. <clears throat> I'm sorry. Are you out there alone or are you coming in or what? sat down in that chair and I said okay just you and me I'm all alone in here and I started to have an EVP session I just taking the radio to Clark and County and stuck it in my back pocket and all of a sudden that radio just full blown static and what? the voice I could hear sounded like the voice of the weather channel Radio band and weather channel. I love. Wait, radio channel, you said? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, if you, if, you turn on, if you turn on the national weather station on the, on the car radio. Uh -huh. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, I love those voices. Yeah. That's what it sounded like coming off over there, but I, was, I couldn't hear it. I'm holding the recorder and everything here, so the recorder. 
reporter picked it up. And it was going off nonstop. Just freaking just yeah. no that. That wasn't doing nothing. Wait, the walkie talkie was going off? Yeah. The flash it that did not go off at all. And then all of a sudden that thing was pegged. I was standing where she was and it was pegged and squealing. And I'm like, what the hell? I feel like we scared someone off. <laughs> I needed witnesses. You guys came yeah. in. I needed witnesses. Come on. You got an audience. I still think someone should play with this thing because I still think it's pretty cool. I would love someone to play with that. I've yet to take it in and use all that. We're sorry, Bill. Sitting right there at first. That's where it all started. I had it in my back pocket. After I got done talking to you, I put it in my back pocket. Not knowing that you weren't done talking. And I sat right there. And it started. I, I sat there and I, I said, okay, you got me here. I thought I just heard something just coming off. Just a okay. I said, I says, okay, you got me here all alone. Let's let's see what happens. And the radio started and I stood up thinking oh I stepped I, I sat on it and I keyed the butt, button up and pulled it out of my pocket by the antenna and it was going nuts it was just a constant <laughs> just constant loud static and I'm like what the hell and then I could hear the voice and by that time I stood up and I heard the voice at first I thought I heard a voice and I wasn't sure didn't sound like you. And then that started pinning. It was one, then the other. And then I played with the volume after a minute to see if, you know, I bumped something when I sat down. And when I turned the volume down, the volume also acts as a squelch. Like and a what? As a squelch. What is that? The squelch controls the strength of the signal. So as you're turning it down, you're also weakening the signal. And the fading stopped. But that kept going. And that's when I called you back and said, get somebody in here. Sorry, what happened? Yeah, it's a little bit different. Yeah. Hey, as soon as you press the button, we're like, oh. You're trying. That's good. We're like, you 